to see African wild dogs in the flesh is a real privilege. It's thought there may only be 3,000 left in the wild, making them one of the most endangered mammals in Africa. Aladdin, the alpha male, wears the radio collar. It really is quite fascinating to watch the alpha pair always together, always together. The male is constantly tailing behind her wherever she goes. Aladdin and Feather have only been together for four months, but they're already off to a flying start. Feather is visibly pregnant. But even though he's now done the job, she is pregnant with his pups, he doesn't leave her side for one minute. It's unusual for an alpha male to be so attentive at this stage. Aladdin seems to be a particularly devoted partner. Taryn has been monitoring Feather and Aladdin's progress from the start. So tell me a little bit about how Aladdin and Feather behave with each other as the alpha pair. We've often seen him with his chin resting on her rear end and just following her around. Um, he's been observed sleeping with his paw on her at night. It's typical, it's what we call mate guarding behavior. He's looking after her. He's making sure that she's, that she's fed and healthy. Once she's pregnant, he continues to follow her, even though he's already done his job and fathered her litter. And I think that's his way of ensuring that his litter of paps survives and, and is healthy. Aladdin and Feather look like a solid couple. And that's good news for everyone else in the group. Because as the alpha pair, it's their job to provide the pack with new pups. So is that it? Are they completely established and their roles are determined and everything's hunky-dory with the whole pack? Well, so far, so good. The, the key will be how successful they are at raising that litter of pups as a pack. Um, the success of a pack always depends on, on, their, on their reproductive su success, so how well they work together to successfully rear they're young. So they're not home free? Not at all, not it, at it, all. So whenever you get a new alpha pair, it doesn't mean anything until they've successfully reared their first litter. Their first litter. Oh gosh, no pressure. Fortunately for Aladdin and Feather, the rest of the group will be there to lend a helping hand. The other adult females are Feather's sisters and the males come from different packs. Yeah, come the rest behind us. It's one big happy family where everyone pitches in. Feather's older sister, Batty, is the lead hunter. By sharing the workload, the pack runs like a well-oiled machine. He's gone in, he's gone in, and he's... The other still got on top of the ground. Oh. Well, most of the time. So you've got wildebeest chasing the wild dogs. What's wrong with that picture? <laughs> When Aladdin and Feather's pups are born, everyone will help to feed and protect them. Here, bigger families do better. 